Hello guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. My name is Anaha. So today's video, we're going to be diving a lot more deeper into genuinely understanding the mind. Because majority of the people fail to understand the basics when it comes to manifestation, which is your own mind. Now, the brain is just a receiver is something that we've heard, right? Brain also has different layers to it. Now, when we say brain has different layers to it, there is your conscious, your subconscious, and super, super subconscious that is connected to the universe, right? Now, this is exactly why. This is where most people make the mistake. They are using their conscious side of the brain to manifest their desire. Now, the conscious only affects like, 5%, just 5%. But the subconscious is 95%. This is why they say that if you want to manifest, you must rewire your subconscious mind. This is exactly why they say when you work on your subconscious mind and you purge your limiting beliefs, that is when you begin to manifest. So in this entire equation, I would like for you to really understand this does mean you have to put in the work to rewire your subconscious mind. And it can be done in literally three easy steps. I'm not even joking. Three easy steps. The first step, I would like for you to say affirmations to yourself every morning. Because it takes three positive words to remove or eliminate one negative word. So imagine all of the shitty things that you've people have told you about you, or you've been telling yourself, of course, it's going to take time. So patience with yourself for long term effects, right? The second most crucial thing when it comes to rewiring your entire subconscious mind is hypnosis. There are a lot of beautiful hypnosis meditations, I will also be uploading some since I am a hypnotherapist myself. I will be uploading few so it can help you rewire your subconscious beliefs. Let me know in the comment section what hypnosis meditation you'd like for me to upload. You know, regarding what topic. Eh, let's see how that works because if you were a client, you know exactly how that goes. That purging is real, right? The third is last but the most crucial. I would like for you to take care of your mind. The reasons why I'm saying this is because the mind does so much for us. Majority of the times when we are unable to love our own mind, it starts giving those reactions, which means nourishing, nurturing your own brain, eating foods that nourish it, getting adequate rest meditating on a daily basis you know mindfulness giving enough inhale exhale calming the mind which is why when your brain is calm you're able to connect to the universe because when your mind is calm eventually with consistent meditation practices you are able to tap into this beautiful brain wave called as the theta brain wave the theta brain wave will is it's almost like um the theta brain wave is almost like this you know it's like you are in your conscious but you made that jump into your subconscious it is almost like you know people say oh i'm i meditate and then i fall asleep it is normal but eventually with time when you're meditating you will stop falling asleep and you will be able to access your subconscious with these with consistent meditation, which costs absolutely nothing. So daily meditation, to-do list, even if it's for 10 minutes, because what this will do, this will nourish, nurture, and also train your mind for you to access your subconscious mind to such a beautiful I have no word to say at this point because none of these videos are scripted, right? In such a way that the moment you think it is going to happen because now you've trained and mastered your ability 
to communicate efficiently with your subconscious mind. Do these three things and watch how the entire game changes for you.